Hi guys, how's it going? So basically we are back in Chiang Mai and we had an amazing trip in Kuala Lumpur in Malaysia. It was so good. There was a slight problem. Basically, we went to the water park and we couldn't film hardly any of the water park. You'll see some of the footage on Ali's channel if you go over there. And basically what happened was, I thought I had swimmer's ear, but after Googling swimmer's ear, which I should have done in the first place, really, then all it is is like water in your ear that makes your sort of ear soft, the skin soft on the inside of your ear. And basically what happened was we went swimming here my ear got really sore, I thought I had water trapped in my ear, so I got some drops. That sorted that out, but then after we went to the water park, then basically for the next two days in Malaysia, you know when you put a shell against your ear and all you can hear is like the sea noise? Well basically I had that for the, the rest of the time I was in Malaysia, so it was really putting me off my like sort of vlogging game, and I didn't want to do any videos and it was just really annoying. I could hardly hear anybody. I had to keep asking Ali to repeat herself. It was so annoying. I honestly went out for dinner and I had to sit like that just so I could hear what Ali was saying like this. It was so annoying. So basically we got back to Chiang Mai and I spent another day here in Chiang Mai with the same thing. I've been using the drops and the drops weren't doing anything. So I was like, oh, okay, I'm gonna have to Google this a little bit more. So. Then I was Googling it and I was like, maybe I have an infection in my inner ear, like past the eardrum. Came onto the thing and it was like, maybe you have like um, a wax blockage or a wax buildup. So I was looking at sort of like home remedies and you can buy like the home remedy kit from the chemist, which is like a syringe, push water into your ear and basically it'll like pull the, uh, the wax out. And I was sitting there, I was sitting there, I was like, well, why don't I try to do it myself? So basically got a bottle, I cut a hole in the lid, and I was like, oh, what have we got? So I had a straw, so I was like, okay, fill this up with warm water, put the straw in here, then basically tip it to me. Yeah. That didn't really work, because I couldn't like, I couldn't hold it, and I had Ali helping me, and we couldn't like hold it and squeeze it, plus the end of the straw was quite sharp, so I didn't want it like going into my ear, so yeah, that didn't really work, so. Then I was like, ooh, a pen. So took the top off one of the pens that we have, got the bottle, pushed that in the bottle. It fits quite well and it's, it's not sharp at all. So stuck that, well it's actually this ear, stuck that in the ear like this and then give it a good squirt, give it a good squirt. And uh, basically I was standing in the shower and Ali was in the living room and I was like squirting my ear. And then I looked down on the floor and there was like these big, black chunks. I was like, what's that in the shower? And I didn't even click that it was wax. I was just like, oh, I must have dragged some something in on my feet. And I was like, Ali, Ali, come have a look at this. And uh, we were both, we had it in our like fingertips and we were like mushing it around. And we were like, what is this? And then like I did it some more and more was coming out and it was coming like out onto my chest and stuff. And we were like, oh, it's wax. And there was a lot that came out. It was crazy. And then, basically, after I did that a few times, I did it like five times. So five of these bottles, like squirting it in my ear. And then after that, I wasn't living in a shell anymore, which was amazing. So now I'm back, I can actually hear. And yeah, I don't have the sound of the sea constantly in my brain, which was so annoying. I don't know if you've ever had this problem, but it was so annoying. It, I just I just didn't feel right at all. I, and after the water park as well, for the two days I was in Malaysia, it was like almost in both ears, like I just couldn't hear at all. It was crazy. So now I'm back. I've got a couple of cool videos coming up. I did bring some snacks back from Malaysia with me, so I've got a Malaysian snack taste test coming up, so that'll be really cool. But yeah, just wanted to let you guys know, look after yourself while you're traveling, and instead of going to the doctors, maybe do some research on Google, you can find some like home remedies. I don't know how I kind of came up with this idea, it was just basically, instead of a syringe motion, I probably should have researched it more, because I didn't really know what was gonna happen if I stopped pouring two liters of water in my ear but it seemed to work 
and yeah it worked really well and obviously you use warm water you can loosen it up with like olive oil and you can even purchase these drops which I didn't use but um, it kind of softens up the wax in your ear but yeah this seemed to work really well and yeah I really recommend it I don't know if you've ever had that wax in the ear oh my god it's so bad it is horrific and basically I want to say a big thank you to Malaysia it was amazing if you like this video please give it a thumbs up hit subscribe down below and I'll see you guys tomorrow bye